What exactly do I teach? Well, I'm gonna talk about that, hopefully using an analogy that makes really good sense. Let's say that you are in the market for a house. You want to build a house, you want to you know, move into a house, whatever, but you want, you want a house. That's what you're in the market for. And let's say that, actually let me just map out kind of the choices out there. So we have a nice purple house. We have a nice black house over here. We have a pink house. We have a tiny blue house. And then we have a green house over there. Green house, not, they don't grow plants there. It's just a green house. That was, oh, I crack myself up sometimes. All right, so you have all these houses out there. You, you are in the housing market. And let's say that uh, you, know, you come across something and it's, hey, you know what? Pink house, that's for you. That's what, there you go. Pink house, it's got one bedroom, two bathrooms, and it's 500 square feet, and it's pink, that's the house for you. Now maybe you're sitting here right here thinking, all right, all right, yeah, that sounds good, I like the color pink. I'm single, so that, that's more than enough. I'm not quite sure why two bathrooms, but I guess, you know, whatever, maybe one's a half bath. But yeah, okay, that sounds good. Maybe you're sitting there thinking, wait a second, I'm a mom of four kids, that, that's, and I don't like pink, that's not, that's, that's not gonna work for me. Well, no, 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 it'll work, yeah, it's, 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 it's gonna work for you. It, just get that. And okay, well, I guess you're the, you're the real estate agent, I'll, I'll just kinda go with it. What do you think's gonna happen to that, that mom of four kids when they move into the house that's too small and they don't even like the color? They, they're, it's not gonna work out for them, right? And that is the problem that is out there within the trading world in terms of learning, in terms, in terms of education, both free and paid. Because I see it all the time with a lot of these free sources where they are coming across saying, the pink house, that's for you, that's how you gotta do it. If you wanna have a great life, you have the pink, no, four kids, no, no, just the, the pink house, that's for you. And that is of course very silly, right? It could, be, it could work out, but it's gonna be a circumstances of each individual person. And what all these are representing here are strategies. Trading strategies within the market. And when I say the market, the stock market, the options market, the futures market, the forex market, the cryptocurrency market, the whatever, the commodities market, any sort of market. That is what is essentially you have out there. There is a bunch of different houses. Some houses are small, you know, big different colors. And any time, again, free or paid, that somebody is pretty much saying, that's the house for you, this house, I like this house, this house works for me, so go ahead, let, learn this. Uh, it, it could work out, it very well could work out, well not really very well, odds are it's not gonna work out because you need to be a very similar to that person. But what I teach is this, I am not into the business of trying to you know, shove a, a pink house down your throat if you have, you know, it doesn't meet your circumstances. The name of the game for me and what I teach, and yes, this is a video, I get this quite a bit, so now I have a video where I can link people to just to explain, kind of could be like, oh, I like your strategy, you know, I, I like what I see on YouTube. Well, yeah, that's my strategy, but that's not, that's not what I'm saying is the only way to work. Yes, I am using technical analysis charts, but that's not gonna be, you know, the only thing that you lose, because a lot of times people are like, well, I see that you only day trade, so you're not gonna be able to help me out from a swing trading. Not true. Sure, day trading may be the greenhouse and you wanna do the purple house, which is swing trading, but what I'm teaching is down here, known as the tools. Oh, that's the worst hammer I've ever seen. What about, let's, let's try the screwdriver. That's not very much better. Anyway, that's a hammer, that's a screw, screwdriver. Um, you know, you have some, some planks of wood. Let's see if I can make this 3D. Look at that. I'm an artiste. All right, so we have the tools. And what do tools allow you to do? If you learn how to use a hammer, how to use a screwdriver, what type of wood to use, where you should use the wood, all that sort of good stuff, what can you do? 
Well, you can actually build a house that fits your needs. You can build a house that is going to work for you. And what is for you? Well, only you are gonna know that. And that is where the tools come into play. And why I'm not gonna sit here and say, you know, the famous one out, well, I don't know if it's not famous, but a very easy sales pitch. Let me tell you, um, you know, if I wanted to just make a bunch of quick sales, all I would do is do this. Hey, penny stocks are garbage. Because they're garbage, they're all gonna eventually go down. So let me show you how to short them because it's gonna be just, it, 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 that's easy. They're, they're garbage, they're gonna go down, so just short them. Okay, yeah, uh, that's, that's a good sound bite. That's a good sales pitch. It makes very good logical sense on the surface, but that's trying to shove a house down everybody. That's just not gonna fit into everybody's personal criteria. That Not everybody is gonna be able to work with that situation because there is a lot of risk that comes with that. And for somebody that's more risk adverse, sitting there proclaiming that that strategy is great for everybody and you can make, well, yeah, maybe some people can make money with it, but not everybody. But for me, I am teaching the tools, and again, this tool is technical analysis, the use of charts, because when you know how to properly use a chart, when you know how to properly read one, implement it, all that stuff, then you can go and build a strategy. So we're working from the ground up. You can build a strategy that best fits you. And that is what, again, Clay, what makes you different than such and such? What makes you different than them? That's what makes me different, is I'm not out there teaching a strategy. If you're saying, well, charts are a strategy, Fair point, but I'm teaching the tool of charts to build a strategy. So I think that charts are a strategy, not really, because they are a, a tool that you can use to construct many different types uh, you know, of angles to the market. So that is what I teach. I don't teach a strategy. I teach a tool so that you can go out there and build a strategy that works best for you. And again, the tool that I am teaching is technical analysis, the use of charts. If you are out there trading alone currently and maybe are in the market looking for a community to join to assist you in your trading or to just help you, you know, give you another set of eyeballs, then I do have a private trading community where you can trade alongside me and other experienced traders. So what you see popping up on the screen right now is both an information link, so if you click on the inner circle one, that is going to take you to the page where I explain all the details of what exactly come with the community, both the chat room and the newsletter. And then the other image that has popped up is a behind the scenes tour where you can see exactly what is going to you know, be contained within the community. I take you through, like I said, a behind the scenes tour of everything, and that way you'll know precisely what you are getting uh, you know, when you join. So definitely check that stuff out if you are interested and thinking about you know, wanting to join a community, and let me know if you have any questions.